Everybody wants you, na na na. Cause everybody wants you, na na na. Uh, I'm just stop. <laughs> Johnny Orlando. All right. Oh, it's been a while. Okay. Let me cut off that. Hello, everyone. My name is Liaison, known by the YouTube name RobotSF2000, and welcome to my first EP review in two to three months. Yes, you heard me. Two to three months since I have done any type of album review slash EP review slash mixtape review. But today we're doing an EP review. So we're only going to do EP reviews for now. So I got a lot of EP reviews coming. Album reviews are on the way. Um, if you want to see the album reviews earlier, then go follow me on my second Instagram account. Real Boss Bitch. Real Boss Bitch Forever Fashion. Go follow me on that account for a lot of shit coming on that account. Just wait for it. It's coming. It's coming. Just go follow. I'll link. I'll put it. I'll put it in the description below. But yeah. Um. Yeah. All right. Today we're gonna be reviewing Johnny Orlando's um uh, newest EP, his second EP called "It's Never Really Over" or "Never Really Over." What's it called? Never. Really Oh, it's never really over. Yes. Okay, it's never really over. So that's the name of his second EP. So it's glad I'm glad to see another project from Johnny Orlando. Yes, indeed. Today we're going to be reviewing his sixth track EP. Um, this EP came out um, on October 23rd, which was yesterday. October 30th. 23rd, I'm sorry. October 23rd, 2020. Um, Friday, October 23rd, 2020. Um, it released. Uh, it's Never Really Over. It's the second EP by Johnny Orlando. It was released October 23rd, 2020. So, can't wait. So, let's not delay this any longer. We're going to review Johnny Orlando's EP. See if it's a good ass EP or not a good EP. We will see. Let's do it. Now, I have heard most of the EP already. I heard the whole EP. Don't even say nothing to me. I heard the whole EP already. I'm sorry if the lighting is so dark. Give me one second, I'll be back. Alright, so, get a little more lighting for y'all. Anyways, what's, what I've heard to do, let's get right into this EP review. Alright, the first... Hmm, the first song off the EP, which he released already, is called Everybody Wants You. Now, if you have not heard Everybody Wants You, then um, I suggest you go hear Everybody Wants You. That's my song right there. Take your time and lose your mind. Cause everybody wants you, na na na. Cause everybody wants you, na na na. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's my song right there. I like that song. Really, Johnny Orlando came up with that song. It was a and then, but what got me on this song is because he cursed for the first time on a song. That's what made me, like, like this song even more. Like, it's about time Johnny Orlando start cursing on some music shit. Because, like, let's say, let's, let's say Jacob Torres, Johnny Orlando don't curse on their projects. As for me, I'm an artist. So I'm mouthy on my own projects. I can be mouthy too. I have freedom of speech. I have my own EP projects and album. If you haven't heard my debut studio album, Rain, then go listen to it. It's not about him. It's about, uh, it's, it's about, it's not about me. It's about him. So, what's good? All right, Everybody Wants You. Now, that's my song. Um, I give the song a 90% and 5 stars. 90% and 5 stars, bitch. That is the best song I have ever heard. And I like I like when he cursed in the song. It was really, it gave it a nice touch that I liked. It really made me like the song more. I liked the song good, but I liked it more. I like that. All right. Now, thank you, Johnny Allen, for that one. All right. All right. Track number two. That was track number one, everyone's here. Track number two, Adelaine. Now, I heard Adelaine yesterday when the EP came out, and I saw the visual for the EP. It was a visual video that came out. And, uh, yeah, visual part came out. So, let's see. Now, Adelaine. God. I'm sorry. Adelaine got me. That song got me. Adelaine. 
If you have not heard Adelaine, Adelaine's a good song. Adelaine, I think about you every day. Oh my god, the vibes, the emotion, the the emotion, the vibes to the song was so amazing. I really like that he put his heart on the table and really spilled that emotion out. I really love that song. I added it to my Spotify just a few minutes ago. Oh my gosh. That is a good ass song. It gets 90% of 5 stars. You know what it is. 90% of 5 stars, man. I love that song. Beautiful. Beautiful song. Alright. Now, let's move on. Track number 3, Bad News. Now, I heard Bad News. And I saw the visual. I saw the visual of, on the cover visual video for Bad News. I like that song too. He put some emotion on the table. He put that raw emotion on the table. He put the vibes on the table. And I really like that he really is putting emotion out there. He's putting that. He's putting that on the table. He's putting his feelings on the table. Bad News was a good song. I didn't add that song just yet. But I get that song. I can't say nothing bad about the song. It's a 90% and 5 stars for me. This song right here. Is good. No lie. Period. Good ass song. Good. Good job. Alright, next part. Um, sorry. It's been a while. Alright, track number four. Flaws. I heard Flaws. Flaws is a good ass song. That song really got me too. That's the second song that really got me. And the third song that really got me. Um. Mm. God. Um, Flaws. Yeah, I heard Flaws. It's a good ass song. As I say, he put the emotion, put his feelings, he put it out there. He write a list of his couple flaws. Everyone's got flaws in the world. Everyone's got a couple flaws about them, basically. It's just. Hands down. Hands up or hands. I don't know. Hands up, good. It's just. 90% 5 stars. I can't even lie. I can't even lie about this. 90% 5 stars. I can't lie about this. This is just too good. Alright. I already added that song to Flaws. I'm not gonna lie that news too. Alright. Next. Next song. Track number 5. Phobias. Now, I heard Phobias um a couple weeks ago actually. I just started listening to Phobias. Phobias. I just started listening to that a couple weeks ago. I saw the music video for the song. I give the music video 10 stars. I give the music video 10 stars. It was good. It was good. Really good. I give the music video 10 stars. The, the setting was right. The music video was nice. The song, I would give a, a 87% and 4 stars. I would give that a really good rating. That's a really good rating for a song. I really like it. The music video was tight. It was nice. It was good. Good setting for a music video. It was really nice. Good job, Johnny Orlando. All right. Let's get to the last track on the EP. Um, track number six, See You. Now, I just heard See You a couple weeks ago it, along with Phobias. I just heard um, See You a couple weeks ago. Um, See You is a good song. Well, actually, he released his song during the pandemic, actually. He just released his song this year. He released it during the pandemic, and uh, he did a music video in his own room. Yeah, he did the, he did a music video in his own room. It was nice. I like that. And the song was good, too. I have to give the song 85% and 4 stars. It was good. The music video was nice because he did it at his house. You don't really have to go extra mile to do a music video. I like that. He doesn't really go the extra, extra mile for a music video. He does the setting that he likes, and he just does it. It's just good. The music video was good. Hands down. 85% 4 stars. Period. Mm. Alright. Now I'm going to conclude the EP now. Usually I don't conclude, but I'm going to conclude it, basically. I do conclude. You know what I'm saying? For the whole EP, I give the whole EP. He, I give the whole EP a hundred percent, a hundred percent. This whole EP gets a hundred percent because all the songs are good. 
But I can't even say nothing bad about these songs. They were all good. They were just all good. And I really listened to the lyrics. Really listened to the vibe of the song. It really got me. I like it. It was really good. 100% for this whole EP. It's never really over. Got 100% in my book. So, yeah. So, you know what it is. This is the end of the EP review. I would like to thank you for watching this EP review. I want you to subscribe. So, 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 excuse me. Subscribe. Hit that notification bell. And join the bass fight. Gang, gang, gang. Slash squad. We are Wild Young and Free. We do not give a fuck. Comment down below. What is your favorite? What is your favorite song on Johnny Orlando's new EP or Teenage Fever? And basically, can't wait. And I'll see y'all next time when I cover the next EP. And I'll see y'all for album reviews very soon. So, go follow my second Instagram account. It'll be in the description. So, go follow that. It'll be in the description below. Alright? So, I'll see y'all next time. Goodbye, guys. Have a good day. Peace and love. Good job, Johnny Orlando.